I'm Grace Nema from Kilifi County, working uh, as a field officer with Plant Village Nuru. Uh, I'll, take, I'll take you through okra production and uh, first of all we'll deal with the planting part. Okay, when planting okra first you have to use variable seeds uh, because we use seeds for okra propagation and the soils that are needed for good okra production is sanda and medium long soils and the okra does well in hot climatic regions especially in the coastal area and then when planting okra the seeds should go into the soil like three to seven centimeters uh, and then during the maintenance period okay for, for as plant village we mostly say that we need to use the good agricultural practices so that we don't interfere the soil with the fertilizer and the chemicals here and there. So in production, when the, if the area is well drained, then we can use the mulch and, uh, and a little bit of summer irrigation, especially during the dry season. So the mulching and the, the irrigation it leads to decomposition of the mulch and we, 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 we find out that at the end we get a well-drained soil so we don't have to use the fertilizers or whatever. whatever. And uh, during harvesting, the okra is ready for harvest when you notice that the kernels are slightly hard and uh, rough. So harvesting is done immediately when you notice the kernels are that hard, they're ready for harvesting. And then harvesting is done after maturity, you can harvest, but it's a continuous process. You can do the harvesting for like four to five times and you at intervals of six to ten days. So per harvest, you skip six to ten days and then you harvest again, that's for uh, about five days. And then the other thing is about the nutritional part. Okra is very nutritious, especially for general generally the health system of a human being so you get it it has a little bit of proteins and vitamins and it can be eaten raw it can be cooked it can be mixed with other with other vegetables like we can mix with mchicha we can mix with uh like skumawiki the way you want it can be eaten either raw or mixed with other with other vegetables yeah so I think generally that is what we uh, what we can we can say about okra. And before I forget, you see, okra is another crop that it does not give the farmer a lot of stress because the moment you plant and you follow the agronomic practices well, you are sure for a good production. You are sure of good yields. You are sure of getting a healthy produce. So if you follow like the weeding, the follow-up when it's in the field, everything is okay. 